I'm quite pleased with that. I said I've got three solar boats in the shed there and that one didn't want to work. So you might be able to see I've ripped the front open so I can get to the motor and then I've been working on the motor lubricating it and in the end I actually put the shaft in the end of my electric drill and gently got it turning and now it's going fine in fact it's going pretty well See, it slows down when it's in the shaded side because it's a bit late in the afternoon now. And when it gets the sunshine on it, it speeds up quite dramatically. Oh, it's still not a speedboat or anything, but oh, I'm glad I got that one working again. When I built this originally, Places like Poundland and Pound World and 99p Store were doing lots of solar butterflies, as they called them. It's a, well, a butterfly on the end of a bit of wire spun round by that particular electric motor and one of those panels. And being as they were cheap, I had quite a lot of them and did quite a few little projects with them. Still in camera up there. Can't see, it's too too bright. No, it's not, is it? Right, you can see it now. Okay, sunlight's gonna catch the panels. And away it goes. I'm thinking of putting some sort of hood on the um screen on this camera so I can actually see what's going on in the sunlight because it's just too bright I'm really pleased with that. It might seem a, a little thing to you watching this, but to me, that's one of my very old projects, and it's still going. I suppose I could just pull it out and show you the motor. Nothing clever. That's the motor that was in the solar butterfly uh, assembly. And I've just got it attached to a shaft with a propeller on the bottom. That particular propeller was actually out of a um, little fuzz buster, I think they call it. A 
like sort of vacuum cleaner type thing. Filled it with foam so there's absolutely no way you can sink it. And originally these little um, washers on there were so that I could go and collect it with my rescue recovery boat that had a fishing rod thing on it with a magnet on the end so you try and actually catch the boat by getting the magnet to pick up the um, washer. Right, well that'll do. It works. There'll be links in the video description to all my solar projects. There are rather a lot of them. Thanks for watching. You'll find more information down in the video description. You might like to watch that video up there. And you might like to subscribe over there.